Nine on your side starts now. The city of Covington is handing out thousands of dollars to help boost small businesses and bring new jobs to the area. That's right. Four businesses are on the receiving end and not on your side. Josh Bazan just happens to be live outside one of those right now. Hey, Josh. Hey, Craig. Hey, Kristen. Two of those businesses will be getting help with rent subsidies. Dixie Chili here behind me and another business will be getting money to help pay to fix up the outside. With that money now in place, the restaurant is ready to move forward with plans to transform the way it looks to people driving by. It's a great location. We have a great community. This is a beautiful neighborhood here. It's called Wallace Woods. Dixie Chili has been at this location on Madison Avenue in Covington for more than 50 years, but the chain's owner says he knows it's time for a little TLC. We're going to put a sign up on the building, a lit sign. What we do is as far as the facade is concerned, it's very important for drawing people in. And we're trying to keep this section of Covington alive. A new sign and new paint trim. That's the next step for Dixie Chili with hopes it will attract new customers. It is some needed improvements the restaurant wasn't able to afford until it got the city to agree to pay $3,500, enough to cover about half the cost. We have put it off for a while because it's so expensive, but the help with the city instigated us to do it. It's very helpful. The city is also giving $5,600 to Lewisburg Gateway to help pay for facade improvements. Core Freight and the soon to open Haven Cafe will get between five and $6,000 each in rent subsidies. The city is betting on these businesses to thrive and says these projects will add 10 new jobs to the area. By trying to do things, change things, um, put the business back on their radar, that helps bring business back in. And it also helps just to improve the image for the community too as well. Small businesses can apply for the next round of the city's program through the end of January. Dixie Chili hopes to get work started on the outside of its building in early spring. Live in Covington tonight, Josh Bazan, 9 on your side. Very exciting for them. Thanks.